Pawn Stars, Rick Harrison's nasty legal battle with his mother explained. Pawn Stars celeb Rick Harrison's involved in a nasty legal battle with his 81-year-old mother, who's suing him. The series premiered on the History Channel in 2009 and has aired for 20 seasons. The Harrison family patriarch, Richard Oldman Harrison, opened a shop in 1988 with his son, Rick. His other son, Corey Big Hoss Harrison, and Corey's childhood friend, Pawn Stars Austin Chumley Russell, also appear on the show. As one of the best reality TV shows, there's still interest in Rick's lawsuit issues due to the popularity of Pawn Stars. Sadly, Richard died in 2018 at 77, but Pawn Stars continues to focus on the dealings at the gold and silver pawn shop. The owners haggle over the prices of the antique and vintage items people bring to the store. The most Rick has ever paid for an item was $250,000, for Maurice Sendak's one-of-a-kind original sketches for the classic children's book, Where the Wild Things Are. According to USA Today, Rick's mother, Joanne Harrison, is suing him in a dispute over family assets and the ownership of the gold and silver pawn shop. As per the Las Vegas Review-Journal, Joanne's attorneys filed the civil lawsuit in Nevada State Court. The lawsuit names Rick Harrison, the gold and silver pawn shop, business entities Harrison Properties, Joe Rich Properties, and others as defendants. The complaint cites a breach of contract, stating that Joanne was married to Rick's father for 58 years. However, when she was hospitalized in 2000 or 2001, just after she'd awoken from a coma, Rick had her sign her 51% interest in the pawn shop over to him. She claims she didn't fully understand what she was signing. In 2018, when Richard died, Joanne inherited his 49% share of the pawn shop, but Rick hadn't provided her with complete documentation of the business's finances. She alleges she hasn't been able to get proper accounting for more than $500,000 worth of cash and silver. She believes the late Richard accumulated those things before his death. Rick's net worth is threatened because the lawsuit seeks unspecified damages, an accounting of assets, a court order banning Rick from using funds belonging to Joanne, and a constructive trust over property that belongs to her. Rick told the Las Vegas Review Journal, the allegations are false, and I think that my 81-year-old mother is being manipulated by others for their personal gain. According to the Daily Mail, in 2020, the gold and silver pawn shop, which usually accumulates over $1 million annually, only made $37,406 because of the COVID-19 pandemic. According to the Daily Mail, Joanne's temporary restraining order against Pawn Stars Rick is to prevent him from selling off the family's assets. She claimed that Rick stopped sending her money from Richard's share of the business. Until recently, Rick gave her regular $25,000 payments but stopped in 2020. Joanne's now trying to have that allowance reinstated through the courts. The restraining order would also stop Rick from transferring or concealing cash assets or performing any other actions that would diminish her interest in the family's business.